The biggest change is the gimbal, which can now rotate 400 degrees and has a much wider vertical tilt range than before. Look how far it can go, it's 70 degrees upward movement. Also thinking it's good to note that Mavic 4 now has no controllable pan movement. I really miss that since the Mavic 2 Pro. The main camera lens is now slightly narrower at 28 mm versus 24 on the Mavic 3. While the sensor is capable of 6K60, in real world testing the footage doesn't look different from the Mavic 3. Shooting in D-Log produces almost identical results, which means I can keep using my existing presets with only minor adjustments. One drawback I noticed was a bit of moiré effect when filming water, something I'll compare more closely with the other drones in my upcoming full 